Rhymebill is now online. Hey guys and girls, so I'm going to show you how to get and set the value of an input box using JavaScript. Let's go! Alright, so here I have the simple HTML page. It has an input box and it has two buttons. And those buttons are going to get and set the value of our input box. And here you can see the code. I just have a simple ID and here I got some onclick events. Alright, so let's go ahead and make up a script tag. In our script tag, we're going to declare a variable. This variable is going to be our input box and it's going to be a reference to our input element. So what we're going to say is document .get element by ID. And if you have an ID on that input box, simply copy and paste it in the quotes. Done. All right. So below our variable, we're going to have a function. This function, we're going to call it get value. And this is going to get the value of our input box. As you remember, we have a button on the top, which gets the value. So let's go ahead and paste this function and an onclick event. And in our function, we're just going to say console.log input box dot value. And dot value is how you get the value of our input. All right. So if we go ahead and save what we have, go back to our website, refresh, and I'll just type in something and then hit get value. Now, if we right click, go to inspect, and then go over to the console window, we should now see we see our input value. As you can see, I just said ye. So there we go. Okay, so now we know that works. Let's go ahead and duplicate our function, change get value to set value because we're going to set the value. And in our function, we're going to replace console.log, and we're just going to say input box dot value and it's equal to, and here you can set the value of your input box, but don't forget, you wanna go up to the top and in your button, don't forget to call this function. Go back to our website, refresh. Now, when we click our set value button, you can see our input box has set the value to ye. And now if you were to click get value, you should now see ye being logged. And that's how to get a set values in JavaScript. And that's it. Until next time, rumble out.